Alright, today we're going to be testing a swing motor that goes on a Hyundai 380LC. Right now I've got the A and B pressure ports coming from the pump going to the motor. I got this as a case drain line which is running back to tank. I've got 160 psi gauge right here at the case so we can see you know, if it's getting too much case pressure. I've also got a gauge back here and a flow meter built in here so I can see if any flow, if there's excess flow or not. Here I've got my standby pressure and my brake release pressure. There's about 480 PSI give or take on these. This here is a makeup valve. Um, it's supplying oil when you shift it one way or the other so it doesn't cavitate the unit. I think it's about 50 to 75 PSI here. Uh, here we're going to be running about, uh, I think the release are set around 4,000 PSI. So I've got a um, post center valve back here and I've got a pressure compensated piston pump. The piston pump is set at about 4,250. So when we turn it on, you're going to see that gauge build up to 4,250. I'm going to pull one of these handles should see it drop down and build back up to where this relief is set at in each direction. So I guess now we'll get started. The, brake, the brakes will hold it locked. Right. Yeah, right now the brakes are holding it locked, so when I hit it, it's going to just be deadheaded. The brake's going to be holding it. This is more or less a parking brake. Probably one gallon a minute flow, which is just fine. It's not even reading on this gauge. And then here, you can see we're relieving at about 4,000 psi. Let go. It's going to build back up to 4,250. So now I've got my brake release and my standby hooked up here. Turn my supercharger on. I'm going to send a signal to both of these lines. It's about 400, 480 psi. Oh, here. So now. A little bit high. Turn the other way. 
Okay, and we still have no clue on the case. Let's shift it the other direction. No flow on the case, there's no resistance, there's no pressure on the gauge. So now, I'm going to release the brake, take the pressure off of it, I'm going to pull this again, the shaft should stop, it should build up pressure once again to 4,000. So the shaft is not spinning, we got our 4,000 PSI, we got about a gallon on the case flow. The other way. Very little case flow. Very little case pressure. We got our 4,000 psi that we're 